Good morning, good evening, good afternoon, and welcome on back to another reaction video. If you have no idea who I am, my name is Sam, aka the OG Bojangles. I'm a first time movie reactor here on YouTube, posting every Tuesday and Friday, and I'm also a streamer over on Twitch. Today's video is a level 5 Patreon tier movie request from Mr. Videotape, and he wants me to watch the movie Stardust from 2007. As per usual, with every movie that I watch on this channel, I have absolutely no idea what's gonna happen and I've actually never even heard of this movie before. But that's the beauty with these Patreon requests. They open up the doors to movies I've never even heard of before. And again, this is the case with this movie. But nonetheless, thank you so much to Mr. Videotape for subscribing at that tier over on Patreon and requesting this film. And with that, let's get started. If you're here watching right now, thank you so much for being here and thank you so much for watching. And for those of you over on Patreon, I also appreciate you guys over there. Thank you so much for being there. Thank you so much for your support. And I hope you're enjoying all the full unedited reactions actions and the access to the polls. If you want to watch the full unedited version of this video or to anything else on my channel, you can absolutely do so over on my Patreon. It is $5 a month for that. I also have a tier over there that is solely for the polls and that is $2 a month for that. So I'm ready to dive on into this and I hope you guys are too. I hope you all enjoyed this reaction and I shall see you on the other side. Enjoy! I am charged with guarding the portal to another world, and you're asking me to just let you through? Yes. <laughs> Give my best to your father. <gasps> oh, what a little sneak. Wow. I mean, couldn't he just climb over it at any other point? Did he have to go through that entrance? <laughs> well, he was correct. See anything you like? Well... Buy this one instead. It'll bring you luck. Costs a kiss. Kissy kissy. Oh, wow. This man just rolled up into this town that he's never seen before. Oh. I'm a princess tricked into being a witch's slave. Will you liberate me? Oh my goodness. Um, you know, that's a little sketchy. We are moving and a-grooving right away. Oh, my lord. A young man returned that night to his home in England, hoping that his adventure would soon be forgotten. But nine months later, he received an unexpected souvenir. Uh, oh, wait. Is it gonna... Nine months later, is it gonna... This was left at the wall for you. It says here his name is Tristan. Wow. <laughs> Moving quickly, yeah. That is actually hilarious. Just a random woman that you met in an enchanted place and you got her pregnant. <laughs> 18 years wow. passed. Oh, wow. And this is the story of how Tristan Thorn becomes a man. Hmm. For to achieve it, he must win the heart of his one true love. <gasps> Who's that? I just thought I could... Oh, what in the... Hello? Tristan Thorne. Is that Henry Cavill? Wow, what a dick. Hello, Tristan. Victoria. Hand the sugar, please. Man. May I perhaps see you tonight? No, but you may walk me home. Now. Hmm. Yes. Yes, uh, I can. Oh, my God. Oh, he is fired. You are... You have no job when you Father, come back. I lost my job. Father, I lost my job. I'm sorry. <laughs> Father, you lost your job. Yes, so I heard. <laughs> Father, I'm sorry. I... Oh, good luck in Victoria. Said... My God. People like you and people like me, we just not. I should be going. It's really late. We can't be together. Sorry. You could do better than her. I don't like her. But the land on the other side of the wall, where the king of all strongholds lay on his deathbed. Oh. Sorry I'm late, father. Sorry I'm late to your death, father. Look through the window. Tell me what you see. It's gonna be a whole lot of nothing. Ha! <laughs> <laughs> the names of Not these oh my good lord 
What if they just throw him off the cliff? Only he of royal blood can restore the ruby. Oh, okay, bye. Um. <laughs> oh my god. What the hell is going on? <laughs> For your hand in marriage, I'd cross the wall and I'd bring you back that fallen star. You have exactly one week, or I'm marrying Humphrey. <laughs> I don't like her! Oh my god, who the hell? Well, now it's time for this journey. Uh, hello? Who the hell are you? A star has fallen. <laughs> we need information. Oh my god, oh, oh! <gasps> she just cut open a ferret? If these divinations are correct, the fallen star lies a hundred miles away. Which of us shall go then to seek it and bring it back? Wow. I've his kidney. I've his liver. And I've his heart. Cheating ho. You'll be needing what <laughs> Oh my god. I was about to say, I'm wondering if the stars make them younger again. Yep. Younger and non wrinkly. <laughs> Checking out her own ass. That's so funny. And I suppose you intend to cross the wall as well, do you? Yeah, he's you not going to let that happen again. Room. Cross the wall as well as who? Uh oh. I better just head for the old homestead then. Yeah. Is he going to do exactly what I his think. father did? Yep. Yeah. Oh, duped again. Oh! <gasps> Old man got more skills now. Damn. Wow. Off you go. Off you go. <laughs> oh, I thought he was going to get away with it again. Well, not again, but just like his father. Why, may I ask, were you trying to cross the wall? I might ask you the same thing. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. My dearest Tristan. The fastest way to travel is by candlelight. To use it, oh. think of me and only me. Oh my god! That scared me a little bit. <laughs> Another one. Uh oh. Wee! Oh my god, there was a body there. I was about to say, what the hell? Oh, oh, mother, I'm so, I'm so sorry. Are you all right? No, I'm, I'm not, and I'm not your mother. So get off me. <laughs> You're the star. You're the star. <laughs> really? Now, if I'm oh. not mistaken, this means you have to come with me. So you're going to be a birthday gift for Victoria, my true love. Huh. Are you insane? Of course. Nothing says romance like the gift of a kidnapped, injured woman. Yeah, right? I'm not going anywhere with you. To the new king of Stormhold. Whichever of you fine fellows it might be. Are they all going to... Are they all going to get poisoned? Wow. Well, uh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Leave a quest with a stone to me. Oh, that was, <laughs> that was great. Vernon, or you'll be sorry. A flooring for you, goat boy. Oh. Uh. Oh no, we got turned into a goat. Oh, uh oh. Oh man, the more magic that she uses, then. Gonna go back to being old and liver spotty. I can't believe she's using goats as her means of transportation. <laughs> ah, yep. So, whereabouts is your. Limbus grass. You dare to steal truth from my lips by feeding me Limbus grass. Oh, damn. You shall not see the star, touch it, smell, or hear it. You will not perceive her even if she stands before you. Oh, man. Whoa. What are you doing? What does it look like I'm doing? I'm sitting down. I'm tired. Please don't okay. do this again. We agreed we stop over the next village to eat and, and rest. Come on, Tristan. It's midday. I never stay up this late. Just please. Yeah, seriously. Sleep. What are you doing? What does it look like I'm doing? Making sure you don't run away. Jeez, yeah, I, I mean, I guess, but damn. Tristan's a little whiny baby so far. <laughs> like, ever since he got to the star, he's been whinier. And I'm like, oh God. But 
We're good. Everything's good. He's all right. Am I the seventh son? Uh. Yes. Another question. Oh, Lord. He's testing him. Throw them again. This time, throw them high. Oh, man. Do you work for my brother? Oh! Yep. Yep. Stabbed. Good night. Wow. Ooh, this guy is... He's on it. Who's there? Hey, he's taking his uh, sweet time, huh? Oh, unicorn? Is that a unicorn? Oh yeah. Didn't Tristan leave midday? Like she said, she's like, it's midday. I can't. I, I've never stayed up this late. Ooh. So it's like nighttime now. It looks like it's darker at least. So it's been a few hours. Damn. He just kind of left her there. Take me away, unicorn. We. Hey, you took a bit, buddy. Oh. Oh. She turned the goat into a human, but he was not a human before. That seems like a lot of magic. That really not really cost, like, her anything? Oh my god, she just keeps staring down at her, her new boobs. And this guy is definitely the embodiment of a goat as a human. A coach is coming. By any means possible, you must get on it. Run. Well, good luck. <laughs> of course it's his. I mean, I guess there was an attempt to jump on it. Get on. Oh, <laughs> yes. Oh, it's a trap, girl. Dun dun dun! <laughs> this freaking <laughs> oh! Take the horses to the stables. <laughs> <laughs> Imagine you're auditioning for a role, and you don't really get that role. But the director is like, you know what you would be perfect for in this movie? A humanized goat. Uh, my name's Tristan. What, what's yours? Bernard. Oh my God! <laughs> the carriage came to me. She's got no, the stone. stone. Yes, they don't get it. That stone away. It, it, it can't be. Oh, oh finally! No, finally! Come here, let me see it. He's dead. He's dead. Bring me the stone now. Chris Clemens, don't trust anything they give you. They tried to put. Yep. Oh my God! It's blue. Girl. Oh. Oh no! And the sword broke. The knife, I mean. Eh, same thing, kind of. What the hell did you do? What did I do? What did you do? Um, think of home. That was a great plan. You thought of your home, and I thought of mine. And we're halfway between the two. Wow. Oh, you where did that come from? What in the Look, world? Catching Shakespeare. That looks like lightning marshals to me. <laughs> I can't believe he's in this movie. What are these cloud pirates? Back to work. We've got lightning to catch. Lightning to catch. Oh, okay. Wow, the new Pirates of the Caribbean movie looks crazy. This movie kind of reminds me of Willow in the way that it's like set in a, you know, a very mystical kind of world and it's basically telling a tale within it. It's it's fun. I like it. You saved my life. Thank you. Good. Oh my god. Where's my stone? She took your brother's carriage. This woman wanted my stone. No. She wanted to tell us how. She said the girl was a star and she wanted to cut her heart out. A witch. Eat it. Mm-hmm. This idiot's coming with us. This poor dude is getting dragged on the adventure by force and it's actually hilarious. A hanging's always good for morale. Maybe we'll watch you dance a gallows jig. Hey! Or perhaps I'll just tip you over the side and have done with it. 
We're just trying to make our way home. Back to a place called Wall, where I come what from. What did you say? Oh! <laughs> That's one lie too many, my son. Oh, boy. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Uh... I'm taking a girl to my cabin and mark my words. Anyone who disturbs me for the next few hours will get the same treatment. What, yo? No, you idiot. I'll sling you over the side as well. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. Okay, I, I had a feeling something was afoot, but I didn't understand how he did that. Tell me news, my beloved England. I want to hear absolutely everything. Oh. Ever tried to get blood stains out of a silk shirt? Nightmare. My right. lord. Uh, it'll be so good to see you out of those dreary clothes. So very small town errand boy, howlingly parochial. Oh my god. Here. This Here. went from interrogation uh, mode, hard man, to that one scene in Mrs. Doubtfire. <laughs> Why fight to be accepted by people you don't actually want to be like? Yeah. Amen to that. Why would anyone do that to himself? Uh-huh. I have a perfect gift to keep you amused on the way. <laughs> Look at the, the luscious locks flowing in the wind. Going more. I'm glad they're on good terms now. Because at first it was a little rocky. Of course. But she was terrible. Face like a bag of frogs. Ugly frogs. Yep. Enough. <laughs> oh. And good luck to you, Tristan, with your Victoria. For the last time, where is the girl? Oh, oh, yep, and he's dead now, too. Goodbye, Ricky Gervais. Oh. Oh. <laughs> wow. Oh, hello. Are you tempted? Immortality? Everlasting life? I imagine it would be kind of lonely. Maybe if you had someone to share it with, someone you love, maybe then it might be different. Yes, that's a... Uh... A fair question if you could live forever but you also had someone who you loved very much with you by your side and your immortality would you do it i think i would and reputation is <laughs> oh my What are you doing here? <laughs> oh shit. Eh, goodbye. Oh, that was something else. <laughs> but now his crew knows technically and they'll they'll still love him. I always knew you were a whoopsie. You'll always be our captain, Captain. Oh my god. Oh, my god. <laughs> Unbelievable. See, at least, again, they're fine. <laughs> my name is uh, Tristan Thorne, and this... That's my flower. Oh. 18 years I've been looking for that. Oh. Give it to me now! Oh, and they finally meet. A gift from his mother. Even not directly just yet. For that flower, I can offer you passage. Food and lodging on the way. Safe passage. I swear that you will arrive at the wall in the exact same condition that you're in now. Oh! What a hoe bag. No! If you can understand me, look at me now. Jeez. I think I love you. Oh. My heart, it feels like, like my chest can barely contain it. Though the walk might take you a little longer than normal, transformation tends to leave the brain a bit scrambled for a while. What was the point of turning into him into an animal? I guess probably just to, you know, lock him up. Victoria's birth is not till tomorrow. I think you need a bath and a good night's sleep before you present me to her. At this point, who even is Victoria, right? Like, she is on the other side of this 
mystical land and you know what she she doesn't matter right like she is not good for mr tristan oh did you really mean what you said in the caravan oh you could understand <laughs> don't ask her to give me a sign well, and, and, and risky being too embarrassed to keep saying such <laughs> lovely things wow <laughs> he told me that my true love was right in front of my eyes and he was right oh if she crosses that threshold into the human realm, our star becomes nothing more than a pitted lump of metallic rock. <laughs> then I suggest you hurry up. I mean, true, right? Um, hello. Oh, a little weird, but you know what? That happens relatively often. In, uh, what? What? Where are you going? Where are you going? Why are you leaving her? Have you seen my friend? He left absurdly early. He told me to tell you he's gone to see Victoria because he's sorry, but he's found his true love and he wants to spend the rest of his life with her. <laughs> what? <laughs> no, he's still probably talking about her. It's fine. He's just playing mind games with you, honey. Happy birthday. I've become a man! Where's my star? Well, it's awfully small. Well, that's just a little piece. A mm. token for your birthday. It's not the star that I want. She's so annoying. You know what I want. Yeah, I do. You want to grow up? Oh! Get over yourself. <laughs> oh! Good for him! Death wish. Oh my god. Oh, Henry Cavill. Oh! Look at that little Harry Potter wand of a sword. Just a measly handful of stardust. Wow. Bang. She can't cross the wall. Yeah, so what the uh the three witch sisters or whatever what uh they said was true that she would turn into like rock or dust or whatever they said. I get why they did this. Oh, Lord. I get why they played it out in this way. But God, he shouldn't have played those mind games with her. He should have just writ written the note being like, hey, I gotta go and just do something real quick, but I'll be back. Not play the mind games with the, what he actually wrote. Yeah, she is gonna turn to dust in a, like two seconds. Come on. Stop, if you go through there, you'll die. What? Oh, oh no. Everything is colliding. If death is what you wish, my dear, I'd be more than happy to assist you. Are you talking to me? Ah. Oh, yep. Yeah. Oh. I forgot about the the curse. I'm sorry. I totally forgot about that. Oh boy. Yeah, she's done. Goodbye. Oh. No more head and also old again. Yo, Tristan, where are you at? Come on. Wow, you arrived pretty late there, buddy. Oh my god. You know, Tristan, I know you had to go to the other side basically to find out that she would turn into dust rock, whatever. But damn, if you just put in the note that you would be back and to stay put, everything would be okay. At least better than what is happening now. What a little tater tot. Oh, Lord. Who are you? What are you doing here? I might ask you the same thing. Oh. <laughs> I love that. Okay, mutual agreement. We're good. Ah, so we're going in for the barge in technique. Okie dokie. I'm, I'm, I'm your mother. Oh, yep. She really hasn't aged a day, kind of. Well, goodbye. One oh, down. Yeah, good oh, yes, jolly yeah. good. Yes, 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 yes. Uh. Oh. And... Oh, man. Good Lord. Ah. Wow. 
And there's all seven brothers. Uh, all right, Una, you get the throne. Run free, ferrets, run free! You killed my brother! Ah! Now that is a unfortunate way to die. Yeah, wow. Come on. You can do this. The she looks, looks like one of those enemies in like a Mortal Kombat <laughs> video game. Wow, wow, wow. Woo! Forgot about the lightning. <laughs> Goodbye, wee! Oh my god, that's so messed up. Wow. Wrong one. Wish you did that one first. And squish. Wee! Oh, not a graceful landing, but it's okay. Six out of ten. Get her old ass. Get her old saggy ass. What? It all seems meaningless now. My sisters are dead. Well, go. Really? After all that, you're gonna say go? Damn. No, I don't. Go. Um, I don't know about this. Yeah, that's what I thought. Yeah. Ooh, crazy ass time. I owe you thanks, boy. Mm. What use was her heart to me when it was broken? And you got rid of my sisters. Now I can have it all for myself. Yeah. <laughs> Hold me tight and close your eyes. What? What do stars do? Shine. Ooh. Get blinded and melted. Ooh. Oh, she exploded. She didn't even melt. She exploded. I'll take it. Wow. Oh, bravo. Yeah. Bravo, bravo. Encore. Hey. The last surviving male heir of the Stormhold bloodline. Yep. It's me, Tristan. Ha! I forgot. I kind of didn't make that connection. Oh. Goodbye. Didn't even make that connection until just now. Wow, I can't believe that. I can't believe they were invited. Oh my god. What was that? What was that? <laughs> Are they having a... Wow. Victoria got nobody then. They ruled for 80 years. Wow. When their children and grandchildren were grown, it was time to light the Babylon candle. They went back to the sky. And they still live happily ever after. How sweet. Aww. A nice sweet ending. Oh, okay, okay. That was fun. That was a really good time. Oh my goodness. This was a very cute, whimsical, fun adventure movie. Again, like I said in the reaction, kind of similar to that of Willow. They definitely have sort of, you know, the same sort of vibe in that sense. And again, just like that movie, this one was a lot of fun. And I feel so silly again, because like I didn't even make that connection until the ruby turned red at the end for Tristan, that he is technically the last male heir of that bloodline i even said when the last brother died that oh, all right una you're that's your throne now i didn't even didn't even make the connection because oh well i think we could all agree that victoria was pretty much just the instigator in some ways in a lot of ways and uh she didn't really matter in this movie <laughs> god she really got annoying huh like she was very very like Ooh, you need to get me, like, m thanks for me, 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 me. Ugh, good lord. So I'm glad that Tristan got a wake-up call from the star herself. 
And again, you know, Tristan was a little, like, a little whiny baby, just a little bit in, uh, towards the beginning, uh, well, towards the beginning of the adventure when he was first meeting, you know, the star. But he definitely got better towards the end. I will say, though, and I know I mentioned it a few times, but that damn note. I'm sure he was just trying to be, like, haha, smart with it, but that kind of ruined everything, and it could have been really bad. <laughs> Things would have just been a smidgen better if he just decided to write them note, hey, stay put, I'll be right back. I gotta go tell Victoria to F off because uh, she's anticipating that I'm, you know, gonna be bringing her back something and technically speaking I am, but uh, you know, just stay put. But he broke her heart. He broke her heart. She really thought that he wasn't gonna come back and that she, he had second thoughts on everything. Like, what is wrong with you? All you had to do was say, just BRB, right? Like, <laughs> I get it though. You know, you had to kind of continue on the plot and make things kind of roll more so and or get just the ball moving in terms of that. But I just, I just can't get over that, you know? But other than that, this was a very fun film. Again, very whimsical, very just magical and just, just this adventure. But again, this was a really fun film, a very fun time. The story was pretty... Uh, entertaining and the whole thing was very whimsical and magical and I think that whole thing at the end where they took that Babylon candle and they went back up to the sky and you know they remained there for you know ever I thought that was very cute Robert De Niro's character Henry Cavill's character those were just funny sort of just like inputs that I appreciated and they're like little look at the end it's like are y'all okay and again i keep comparing this movie to willow but at the same time i feel like there are a lot of similarities with it and i enjoyed this movie how i also enjoyed willow as well so i thoroughly enjoyed myself watching this really do hope that you guys enjoyed this reaction and of course mr videotape really do hope that you specifically enjoyed this reaction if you did have fun with this reaction please feel free to like the video and if you aren't already please feel free to subscribe and if you wanted to watch the full unedited version of this video or to anything else on my channel you can absolutely do so over on my patreon it is five dollars a month for that and to those of you who are already on patreon thank you so much for being there thank you so very much for your support and i hope you're enjoying all the full and edited reaction videos and the access to the polls if you want to find me outside of youtube you can absolutely do so you can find me pretty much anywhere at the og bojangles twitter instagram tiktok all that good stuff but i'm mainly over on twitch and streaming over there once again this was a very fun movie a very fun time very entertaining, and I had a great time with it. And again, really do hope that you guys enjoyed this reaction, and I hope to see you all in the next one, whatever that may be. Okie dokie, toodaloo, adios, and goodbye. Bye.